It's the Brewers and Cubs deadlocked after 162, needing an extra game to see who wins the National League Central. Brewers, Jose Quintana, 4-1, a 2-1-7 ERA. He has done a phenomenal job against Christian Yelich, which virtually nobody else has. Yelich, of course, is the MVP candidate. The other thing to note, Jonathan Scope is back in the lineup at second base. When there's a lefty on the mound, he plays. He plays, and also what's going to play today? He's off for the Brewers. First pitch swinging, Baez. Nifty play at short, and one pitch, one out. High chopper on the infield. Baez is going to barehand throw, not in time. Hard on the ground to short. Baez the flip, and Murphy's throw. Allows Rizzo to hold the ball. A double play. Yulis Chassin is on the mound. If they started the lefty, then perhaps you would have seen Zobris lead off. But they go with Chassin, and Javier Baez, of course, anchors everything. He's, he's got a great slider, and when he locates that, that's a very difficult pitch, and he's been very good against the Cubs. And third. And Murphy elevates this one. Kane slow, and now he is under it and waves off Arcia, the shortstop. 3-1, Zobris ripped it into right. That's where Yelich is towards the line, and he's there. For the second out. Mm, much better, Eddie, just what you had uh, described, and that time she's seen. Yes. Aguilar back up the middle, and that's a hard single for Jesus Aguilar. Second hit of the day for the Brewers against lefties versus somebody like Travis Shaw. They're better. Brian shot to Bryant, though, and he is retired. Eric Kratz, the catcher. And this ball to left. And another good, easy, effective inning for Jose Quintana. Saying he's big enough to move <laughs> a piano. And it's this one to center. Lorenzo Kane and all his defensive runs saved this season make the easy catch. And hit it really hard. Schwarber hard on the ground. Aguilar for one. Back to him. Double play. Nice play by Jesus Aguilar to start. 3 2. That's ripped. And another hit for the Brewers who've had one hit in each of the first three innings. Looks like Shasim may attempt it with two strikes to get it down. He does. And Rizzo fields it. That was going to be close. You think that was going to stay fair? Yes, you have to make that play there. Garcia, big lead. That one is fielded by Baez, which saves a run. Nice job by Javi Baez over there at short. That was huge. Game, division on the line. And he delivers. Christian Yelich knocks in Garcia. And the Brewers go up one to nothing. That's what you'd expect from Christian Yelich this season. Yelich goes, throw down, not even close. So Yelich in the scoring position with two outs. And Contreras will throw it down to Rizzo for the out. But Christian Yelich in that MVP type moment. So uh, the hitter ahead of the pitcher get on. That allowed the pitcher to bunt and they scored a run. In this case, Hayward is going to be retired with the pitcher Quintana coming up. I think it's interesting that he had to wait until Contreras got to the going down and away. Yeah. Nasty pitch, Quintana, another good inning. And now you kind of believe the wheels start to turn for Craig Council. That's out of his ability. That ball is to right. Go ahead, finish it. Well. Mark Grace once described him. One down the middle here. I'm throwing the slider. Yeah. Ooh. He had a home run thought for sure, but he popped it sky high. And Braun is there. Chassin does it again. Jeff was put up as great as their stuff is. Kratz has got to be responsible for some of those. Can we move on, please? <laughs> and another hit for the Brewers. Garcia. Takes a hard turn around first. Garcia and Yelich, two each. 
Chassin, good bunt here. Quintana waits for Murphy to occupy first, and he throws to first for the out. Popped up. Hayward says it's mine. It'll still run it through four. And they've had one base runner, Bryant, with a walk. is three for three today and we have seen three very different hits i was in dc in maryland really couldn't quite understand fantasy 61 games a 260 era gone nice job by chavez the ball fouled into the mitt and Contreras holds on to it on the ground double play ball bryant murphy rizzo Because if you lose, you're still not done. Right. He got it. And he got it. Double play started by Chassin to scope. So they near 2-0, 243, 47 appearances on the season. But they know that tomorrow plays just as big as today. Murphy over the head of Jonathan Scope. And the Chicago Cubs with two outs. Got a base runner on. Peter or Jeffress at all. Let's not forget, though, what Council told us the other day. He's used 12 pitchers in September. To... He got him with some high heat at 94. Wow. Right up for the Cubs. Mustak is swallowed. In a shift, Bryant's the only guy over there, and he grounds out to the third baseman for the second out. Kratz to second, and Murphy takes his time with it. Chavez has been rock solid. Now Corey Knebel against Rizzo. His numbers, Corey's crazy. Rizzo three for nine with a home run and three walks. Hit hard, and the shift against Rizzo pays off as Knebel retires number 44. Wanted it high, exactly where it went. Bryant is retired. You talk about hitting the glove. And that's now in the game for Joe Madden and the Chicago Cubs. Orlando Garcia two for two today. Since Lee they King. got it. Uh oh, Garcia as he left one up in the zone delivers his third hit of the game and a big leadoff base runner. Stay first. Rip fair ball down the line. Santana the ball into the corner. Garcia to third and second and third. Nobody out for the Brewers. Field in. You got Steve Cishek on the mound. Pitches really well against right handed hitters, but Lorenzo Kane. Back up the middle, and Lorenzo Kane looks at his bench as he drives in. Garcia. And the Brewers grab a 2 1 lead in the eighth. And the numbers that have been great, as we look at Randy Rosario's numbers, are Christian Yelich's against lefties. Strikes out and a huge strikeout. Huge strikeout for Rosario. Again, we like to say small sample size. But two for two against Brandon with a double. He goes. And that one is over the head of Murphy. Kane will go to third. Braun delivers. And a huge add-on run for the Milwaukee Brewers with two strikes. 
There he goes. Pitch outside. Contreras throws down. Out at second base. Now in Braun. Six outs away from it. Aguilar into left. And that one hangs up there for Zobrist. Now on for the Milwaukee Brewers. The numbers are absolutely absurd. 15.9 strikeouts per nine. The deception in the delivery count. That is what makes him so filthy. We saw 97, then we see a little slider there at 83. Hit hard, but at the second baseman, and just like that. That time he got it up, and Hader picks up the strikeout. Kratz pumps his fist. But Madden continues to plow through that bullpen, and a Garcia. On the ground, Bryant stays down on it. Throws across the diamond to retire Scope. Mustakis, that one is past the dive of Murphy. And he may have jammed his shoulder a little bit as he dove for that. Hammered in the left. What a day for Orlando Arcia. The shortstop is four for four. It's a fair ball. Contreras will get it and fire to first to Rizzo to retire the side. Oh, oh my goodness. Make that 0 for 5. There it is. 0 for 5. 5 Ks. The number one. Playable. You guys talked about the sun. Broxton seems to see it. And the Brewers are one out away from a Central Division title. Nice pitch of the at bat. This is one on the left center. It's going to allow Rizzo to bat. Baez, woo, he thought about it for a second and wisely. <laughs> right field, playable. Roxton, game over, division over. The Brewers are champions of the Central.